Right out then folks, so uh, very special video for you today. We're actually going to Stockport and uh, Chris has got more information about this. We won a car folks. A YouTuber called Jeff Buys Cars did a competition to win a car. So bought some tickets, won a car. Right then folks, let's go. <laughs> See you in a bit. Where are we at, folk? We are, I don't know. Where are we, Chris? Up in Hood County. We're what there. I can't see that. Near Hucknall. So how far have we got now? It's only like 40 miles, isn't it? One hour and nine minutes, 40 yeah, miles, yeah. Here, else. 44 miles, actually. Yeah. Check the check the channel out, folk. Check that out, folks. Check Escape the, the chaos. Yeah, we haven't said that, have we? Have we're, we um, we're leaving cards in service stations, every one. Yeah, this is the second <laughs> one. <laughs> Just give it to some random Yeah, just here. anyone. Excuse me, mate. There you go, it's gone. Let's see if you can sit. Wow. There it is. Yeah. I'm surprised that it fell down. That it's is like, cool. Slow down, folk. Oh, I'm only doing 35. <laughs> oh, I see. The Peak oh, District yeah. National Park. There's oh. The official. We're, we're, yeah. You want to film that here? That's quickly? one of those yeah. No, I so think that a is a welcome. welcome. That's a mill stone yeah. shaped. Well, here we are then, folks. Watch the cyclist, lad. Watch, well, watch out for the Yeah, I'm just being but, careful with the condom. At the moment, if we're going the wrong way. Just to look at the views. Oh, because yeah, look. look see, at I the wouldn't views. have seen that. It's like a uh, lovely little holiday place. I like that is church. Is this where Chatsworth House is? That is Massive a nice house. church. Yeah, I would have grown there. Stop the drone, Chatsworth. Gothic. Oh, I didn't know if anyone else wanted to, so. Right. Sorry about it, folks. It's a bit all over the shop. This is like a crazy driver. The just roads, like, folk. Have a little fun people church thing. This just look, reminds me of driving up the gorge from Cheddar. Yeah. Look, this classic car show. All right, all right, Beamer's nice. <laughs> yeah, I actually quite like the colour. See, we waved. Yeah. It's mental, isn't it? Nice, yeah. Bit of rain, so rain comes down here. Because this is obviously carved out by the water, the road. Yeah, and then they put a road in. Yeah. This is where we found the stray sheep. Yeah, I parked in front of that gate. Well, there we go then, folks. Oh That's my God. The, you parked in front of the gate. I parked in front of that gate, yeah. Okay. What's wrong with that? Because it's for horses and stuff. Well, there's another forth. road there they can go across. Where? Horses, it is. horses can't get across there. Right. Because of the cow grid. Well, they should put skis on them then or something. <laughs> I can't believe you just said that. <laughs> They're going to ski down the slope. <laughs> So we picked up this Volvo, uh, it's a gold Volvo, what is it? The it's a uh, T5. T5 a petrol. Fast one. Um, and it looked a bit like an old... Uh, big but, clapped out. No, big clapped just, out, yeah. But you know, for, for a ticket, it's good. It's um, 1997, I believe. And it's done 450,000 miles or something. Wow. Yeah, so what Mate. we're going to do now, we're going to go to a petrol station, we're going to park up and then maybe drive into a car park somewhere. Yeah. Not in a petrol station, but we're going to get petrol for it. And then um, we're going to have a little tour of it, folks. Have a look at it, see what you think. Definitely. We're in Stockport, uh, and now we're on the way to a Stockport petrol station. So let's go. See you later, folks. So there we are, folks. Here we are. How many miles has that got to do? 300 basically? Uh, yes, yeah, about 300 home. Yeah. Think about it, it's not like this, it's, this is only nine years newer, this car. You can do this well, and there's one pack on this. <laughs> <laughs> no! Well, you can't get that much out of Really? Yeah. Okay. Do you want to be going? Yeah. Uh, also, don't forget you owe me 25p for that air as well. Pay you in sweets. Where's the talk button? Yeah. What have you got? Four handbags. Kat said she'll trade it for a fruit pastel. So basically, we got some air in the tyres <laughs> <laughs> and um, petrol. So right now we're starting to drive. 
Uh, this is what it looks like in, 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 in Chris's car. Someone replied, you're in Chesey. No, I'm not in Chesbord. Where's that? This route avoids road closures on M56 near Runcorn. You are on the fastest route. You should reach your destination oh by 1531. I'll have a warmed up pork pie instead. Turn left onto Ashton Road. Tell him I'll leave it this one. Take the next one. left onto Ashton Road, A560. If I leave it in the window in this one, it'll be cooked in about half hour. <laughs> That's the GoPro. true. The GoPro. Ian's trying to film, but I love this walkie business. We actually need to just have walkies for the car because it's great. Apparently, according to an IKS plan on the page, we're in Cheddar Gorge. <laughs> Did you ever, like, um, Chris, when, when you met Steve, Is that, are you allowed to do that while driving? Yeah, I am. Um, did you ever put one in the tent and not like, scream out to wake him up? What was that? Put one in the tent and put one out by the tent. Yeah. There they are, folks. Did you hear any of that? Uh, not really understanding, folk. Something about screaming at Steve? Yeah, I was wondering if you ever... Sorry, I was wondering if you ever used walkie-talkies, like put one in the tent uh, to wake up Steve, like you not make noises in the middle of the night. If I remember rightly, they went dead overnight because it was so cold. It seems to drive okay. Um, brakes are a little noisy, and it sounds like it needs a wheel bearing. <laughs> Shall I take you for service? This has actually been to a Volvo specialist last time it broke down recently. The first one, here. No. What? That one over oh. there. Keep going. Yeah. The police saw me on the radio then, but they clearly. Exit the roundabout onto the slip road. Right, so yes, in Chris is in the car, folks. Merge onto M60. It's going to take us to get used to it. It drives completely different to the other one. Yeah, that sounds good. It sounds like a racing car. Jeez, they used these. They actually did two years of racing touring car racing they use the 850 so 
so it has pedigree. So you've wanted one of these for a while? Well, I actually wanted a V70 T5, a bit newer, because I don't know much about these. But, you know, this was, this was what, this was one. Yeah. I mean, pounds. I know a lot of people are going to be like, why, you know, why would you even enter? But you've got to love an old Volvo. Yeah. And the fact of the mileage. I mean, it's supposed to be one of the highest there is. is that uh, on a T5. 569. 464,000. Oh. So, yes, yeah, looking good, folks, looking good. I think there's a lot of bits that are like falling off. What did he say? What's that? Yeah, it's pretty fast. One thing I did just work out, pulling out and coming up behind you, naught to 60 is much faster than 60 to naught. They're not problems, folk, it's character. So do you approve of said car? I reckon so. Um, I mean, I don't think the other one that you had on offer would have been half as much fun because it was much newer. What's that? Say again. Third exit. Third Folks, so we must be about halfway there, aren't we? Um, well, halfway to Dover. Yeah, we, we didn't take the Birmingham turn off, but I suppose we're close. Yeah, we're um, 196 miles, which is three hours and seven minutes, folks. So yeah, quite away. Still quite away. Yeah. Uh, and the Volvo, folks, is still running strong. No problems as of yet. When we get onto a decent piece of road. Cat is going to have a job of finding out a where the fuse box is and b what fuse the blower might be, and then we'll take it out of something less important, like your car. I didn't hear that, folk. The road's a bit noisy, and you think your suspension is uh, a bit harsh. Mm. This isn't a soft, comfy Volvo. The seats are, but there isn't any suspension. There he is. This car coming past, eh? I want to get that one open. Where? Both. Is he rear? because that's what I was going to put in, but I could only get in 84.
plus two lots of um, M6 tolls and three Darfur crossings. Yeah, so what, 200 then with the uh, tolls, uh, what another 750 with the crossings, and then what the 30 quid on food, so it's definitely less than 250 isn't it, or maximum of 250. And we've had a day out, and we picked the gearbox up, so yeah, it's good. Yeah, and um, also did, uh, what was I going to say, I don't know what I was going to say. So it's a hundred quid savings, didn't you get? 350 was the cheapest pro. There was one more that came through that I think was like 330 odd, but I mean, yeah, pretty much. And like I said, day out, we saw some parcels. And I mean, how do you, you know, even just talking to the guy and finding out issues with the car, it's probably worth it rather than it just turning up and I open the window and it falls out, and you, you know what I mean? So it's probably worth meeting him anyway. And we've got to drive the car home to know what the car's like. True that. So that only costs 85 quid to fill up. I know that obviously the, the petrol's cheaper, but that sounds like that your, your tank is smaller than mine. So I'm sure this is a 70 litre tank in this. According to the gauge, this is a 70 litre tank, but it wouldn't let me put any more in it, so click, 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 unless it wasn't completely full. Maybe it's one of those ones that, you know, when you get to a certain point, you've got to do it slow or something, I don't know. Yeah, maybe. Or maybe the gauge isn't reading right and uh, there was more in it than it said. Folks, just an update. Yeah, it's dark. It's real dark. Chris is in front there, uh, and it's, we're just under 40 miles to Dover now, so we are needed there. Stockport to Dover. Uh, long way. Real long way. <laughs> uh, the car's now on 577 miles from half past five this morning. Wow. It's been a good day, though, isn't it? It has, yeah. With a couple of castles. Yeah, 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 going to be on my channel at some point, so check them out, folks. Escape the chaos. Right then, folks, made it home. 321 miles later. Oh, boy. That's not bad on fuel, is it? And we've still got about a quarter of a tank. Yeah, so it's done well, isn't it? So I think it's done well. So that's less than, less than nine, well. From I reckon, bearing in mind it's still got a quarter of a tank, probably less than £80 all the way home. Yeah. And in fairs, on the way up there, what did you reckon? 40 quid in 40, yours? 40, 50 quid. Yours. Outside temperature, 9 degrees. Probably. Inside temperature, 25.5. That sounds a bit high. But, uh, you know. Yeah, there we go. Have a picture of that. Right, then, folks, we made it home. God, it's freezing cold now. So how many hours was that? That's uh, like 9, uh, 10, um, 12, 11, 13, 12, 14, 12, 15, 15. 17. Bloody hell, folks, yeah. Roughly. 17 hours later, we're home. Yeah. yeah. So no, was no, wasn't, we did do two explores. Two as explores well, as well, yeah. Um, stock, was it Stock? Stockport. 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 Manchester. Yep. Uh, picked this car up, looked like a bit of a banger at first, and... Uh, made it home. Made it home, indeed, yeah. And it's like a bit of a... Bit of a uh, it's a bit of a project, isn't it? Yeah. 300 and, what, 315 miles later? It's not done bad, is it? No, it hasn't, really. Doing well. Nothing fell off. <laughs> it's true. Uh, number plate even stayed on. Yeah, even the number plate stayed on. Well, it fell off once. All the lights yeah. worked. Heated yeah. seats. Yes, thank you very much for watching, folks. Different video. Um, Check out yeah. Facebook, Instagram, and all that jazz. And Escape yeah. the Chaos. Yeah. Uh, yeah. And uh, future <laughs> updates on the car, obviously, will be coming as well. So, see you soon. See you soon, folks. Bye. And Mal says bye. Oh.